Well, I normally like to get out into the community, be a mentor, be a volunteer, see what I can do to really impact people's lives. And I had only been here at WAFB for a few months, and our assistant news director came to me and said, you know what, I think you would be great for this fundraiser that we do called Dancing for a Cause. And I said, well, does that involve me dancing? I don't know if I want to do that. <laughs> but then I met everybody that was involved and I heard about what the, the cause was for and, and who it benefited and it's people with disabilities. And I jumped in and practiced all summer and had the performance and it's definitely a memorable experience. So apparently my knee was injured a long time ago and I didn't notice it. I'm a, a runner. I would run several miles a week. I ran a half marathon on a knee that probably wasn't the best and I didn't have any problems with it. But dancing, you're moving sideways. Running, you're moving forward. When I started moving sideways, my knee started to hurt a little bit. So I went to the doctor, they looked at my knee and they said, you have a torn meniscus. I would not have known that my knee was injured had I not done dancing for a cause. So it may sound bad, but the silver lining to it is I was able to get my knee repaired and now I have many more years on a much better knee that I got it fixed than I would have had I not gotten it fixed. So I found out what was wrong. So I've spent the last several years in North Carolina. Being from Louisiana, North Carolina was very different, but we enjoyed it there, had a child there, decided to finally come back home. And I think it was my first week here at WAFB. One of the photographers came into the newsroom and screamed, hot booty. I was like, that is so wonderful. I'm officially home. <laughs> so I, I didn't know if we left at the right time and if it was the, the perfect thing to do. But when I heard that, I thought, no doubt, I'm supposed to be here. Hi, I'm Johnny Asian. Thank you for checking out the WAFB YouTube channel. Like what you see? Go ahead and subscribe by clicking this box and you'll get notified when new content is released. Make sure you also download the WAFB 9 News app for breaking news alerts sent right to your phone.